Hello, Trinidad, my fellow Trinis. Hello. I would like to thank the TTFF for awarding me this beautiful, beautiful gift of the best actor in the beautiful, lovely, hilarious, dramatic movie, The Rise and Fall of John Tesoro. Uh, is this a posthumous award? At my age, this could be, couldn't it? But I guess not. I'm still talking, right? Now, I really wish I were with you guys today. I really wish I were with you guys. I'm serious. But because of personal reasons, I couldn't afford the airfare. And my good friend, Simon Batiste, offered me the airfare, but then I realized it was a one-way ticket. So just now I'm stuck in Hollywood while you're in this beautiful island of mine, Trinidad. Now, a lot of people say, maybe Jerry is the dream of this. One day, I'll be what I'm doing now. No, I never had this dream because if you consider where I grew up in a little, little village, Pinal, in Trinidad, a little poor little guy, my ambition was really to be able to afford one day a whole tin of condensed milk so I can drink it all by myself. That was the extent of my ambition, okay? Now, I would like to thank a lot of the people who are responsible for my happy trip to Trinidad. I will start from my end. Angela, our beautiful director, Jim, Richie, and Raphael. And on your end, of course, the irreplaceable Simon Batiste, the airfare guy, remember him? Sean, and the entire cast and crew, especially the makeup people, the hair, and the wardrobe, who made me look presentable for this movie. And believe me, they had the work cut out and they did a great job. Thank you guys. Now, the person I would like to thank the most is my precious Catherine, the mother of my beautiful son, Douglas, and the grandmother of the future Miss Universe, little granddaughter, Ashley, who is blessed with a great mother, Edna, and a brother, Brandon. Now, I would be remiss if I didn't mention, of course, Sandy right there and my little darling Slippy, that's my cat. Of course, I'll be more than remiss if I didn't mention the name of the person who is solely responsible for exhuming my career, the darling of Hollywood director, Judd Apatow, who had the courage to put me an unknown in his first blockbuster movie, The 40-Year-Old Virgin. I want to thank Judd very much for that. Now, there are some names I didn't mention, but I want to assure you it was purely intentional. And there are some people I hang out with without whom I would have been in a much, much better position. Yes, you heard right, better. But let's talk about the real people. You, my Trini friends, you are the real deal, okay? I want to thank you for accommodating me, for allowing me to come to Trinidad and relive my past many, many times. You're the best. I'm, look for, I'm looking forward to meeting you again soon. I really, really, really miss hanging out or liming with you. I want to bust a lime when I come down here. And Drink some rum and coke and eat up some doubles and sauce. Oh, God. I can't wait, darlings. Okay? See you soon. Be there. I'm coming. I love you.